dudes, back at it again for part three of the DVD collectible gift uh, set, collectible 10 videos, just kind of an all-around box set videos. Um, for part three, I'm going to start off with one that my wife bought for me. She bought me this uh, DVD set for an anniversary gift uh, a while back. It's been about five, six years ago, maybe. Probably not that long ago, because I don't think this movie's been out that long. Let me check the date here real quick. It was 06. It was around 06 when she bought me this one. It's the V for Vendetta uh, gift set. It's a rather thick box. It takes up some space on the shelf. But it's got all the goods on the inside. And what's really cool is if you pop the little Velcro cover here, you've got the V mask, or the uh, Guy Fox mask there. I always thought that was pretty cool. Just kind of neat. It's got the uh, kind of a rundown on what's included. It's got the uh, little lobby cards there in it. It's got the two disc special edition of V for Vendetta. Um, the Guy Fox mask, of course, kind of like a collectible deal. It's kind of hokey, but I don't know. V for Vendetta, you know, there again is a movie that uh, probably didn't hold real real close to the comic books and it pissed off a lot of people in the comic book uh, collecting community. I happen to like the comic very much and I also like the movie for what it is. Um, I didn't think they did a real bad job with the movie, but they just kind of modernized it and just did what they thought was right. And I don't know. It's kind of that whole deal with uh, Watchmen, who was done by, who was originally made by some, the same people, and it's just one of those deals where you kind of just have to take it for what it is. I enjoyed the movie for entertainment purposes, so it was just real fitting to get a, a cool box set for my wife there. I always, I always cherish that one a lot, and it's got a special place up there in the comic book uh, shelf. And again, V for Vendetta. Uh, I won't take all the stuff out because it's kind of hard to get stuff back in, but that right there shows you the innards of it. You get the two disc special edition, the mask, and all the lobby cards that go with it in the booklet. So anyway, V for Vendetta, pretty cool set there, pretty cool set. You'll have to forgive this one, guys. The next one is in full screen. It's before I got into the widescreen trend. Whenever DVD was first starting off, the first purchases I made was probably one of the first purchases there again was uh, the Star Wars trilogy when it came out on DVD. And I don't mean the first trilogy that they've done after the fact. I mean part four, five, and six that I grew up watching in the early 80s, late 70s, early 80s. Uh, New Hope, Empire Strikes Back, and Return of the Jedi. This, of course, again, again is the full screen version. It's one of these days I'll tackle getting it on widescreen. I just haven't done it before. I just I just haven't made time to go back and find these. Now you can find these really dirt cheap now um, at like used stores, uh, used movie stores, or at certain video stores if they've rented them out enough, they'll sell them off the shelves, things like that. This is actually not just a three disc set for these movies, but it's a four disc set with all three classic films, uh, surround sound mix, and a fourth disc that has all the uh, all the special features for these movies. Pretty cool set. Um, uh, it's kind of, I didn't really like the way they made that. It's kind of like just a cheap cardboard flap that opens. Really all that's inside is just a, uh, just the four movies or the four discs there. I think you can see that. So there's not really a whole lot to it, but it was pretty cool how they packaged it and gave it, gave it its due, put it in the original set all together. Um, I hope they'll do it for the first three. If they haven't already, I haven't been paying attention. So there again. The original Star Wars films. Uh, let's see. What we need. Let's do some VHS for a change. Let's mix it up here a little bit, guys. Um, I found this one at Dollar General. Dollar General is just a, you know, it's a, a chain of stores that keeps our household goods uh, flowing for the home here. Uh, whenever you need soap or uh, detergent, whatever. But sometimes they have like, uh, whenever they offload VHS tapes when DVD took off or uh, they get like closeout things on a smaller scale, not like big lots, but they get they get some cool stuff every once in a while. I got the Band of Brothers. It is the HBO World War II miniseries that was, uh, I believe, produced by Tom Hanks after he did Saving Private Ryan. But it's a really cool box set. You'll never guess how much I paid for this. I paid like four ninety nine. I think right at five dollars for this box set about five years ago. And uh, it's pretty neat because the DVD box set is cooler. I mean, it's got a collectible tin and it's, it's a little bit cooler. But for a, for a VHS, for a set that I'm going to watch, you know, pretty often and on, I've still got a couple of VCRs here at the house. 
why not go ahead and get it? And I was in, you know, it's six VHS cassettes. It does take up a lot of room on your shelf, but it's got a cool, you know, face pictures of the people in the movies, some stills there, synopsis on the back. Um, I'll show you what it is. It's like a snap case here. You undo the Velcro, and it flips open, and it's got. Uh, Try not to spill the tapes on the floor. <laughs> it's got the collectible. Uh, flip out here. It's sort of like a small poster that it flips out into and it says Band of Brothers there. Tom Hanks and Steven Spielberg present. And there's all the films on the other side there all kind of lined up. It says the uh, the name of the episodes on each tape. And I don't know. It was a cheap purchase and I still have VHS players so why not hang on to it. I watch it about once a year. I, whenever I get nostalgic or around Veterans Day. Uh, myself being a, a military veteran myself, I like my war movies every once in a while just to kind of, I like the history involved with it and everything. Band of Brothers. You might be able to find these VHS tapes if you're still in, you know, if you're not worried about watching them on full screen or anything like that. Band of Brothers. Pretty good set for cheap. Another one that I got from the same store, let's talk some more VHS tapes here. Hmm, pardon me. Was the, uh, I got from the same store, the Big Lot stores, or no, uh, Dollar General stores for $4.99. It's the complete original core set of Rocky movies on VHS. And see, so you got Rocky 1 through Rocky 5 there. Um, I do have uh, the Rocky 6, or as they call it, Rocky Balboa. I've got it on DVD over there. But uh, for the purpose of this video, let's just show the, the gift set or the box set here. It's pretty cool. It's a red box set. It's the 25th anniversary, which is a few years back now. But uh, I thought it was pretty neat. I uh, left most of it in plastic here. and uh, It's pretty cool because if you don't mind watching them in full screen, uh, I only get out my... I've watched Rocky movies so incessantly growing up. I've got like every line in every movie memorized. So I rarely will watch these just unless I'm just in the mood to. So I've decided just to keep them on VHS until I just can't stand it anymore for, or unless I find the... The, uh, the core films here on DVD for dirt cheap, which they haven't come down in price really a whole lot over the years. So maybe one of these days I'll get them on Blu-ray or something cool like that. But anyway, five bucks, the original set. Had it for a while now, still enjoying them. Now let's talk a movie tin here. Um, everybody knows about the, uh, the gold edition as it's passed around the conversation of the uh, Texas Chainsaw Massacre here. Um, that's not what I'm going to talk about really. The Gold Edition is the definitive edition, in my opinion. I've, I've done a semi-review on this before. Um, it's got all these great special features on it, and it, I think a lot of people agree this is the one to get. But what's really cool that I found about recently, this is the Blu-ray version, but the one I want to talk about is the collectible tin for the two-disc special edition DVD version of the same, the same presentation. Um, it has all the exact same special features on it, guys. It's just spread over two discs instead of one disc like the uh, Blu-ray presentation. I personally prefer the Blu-ray because it's in high definition. But guys, you've got to get out there and get this one before it gets gone. Go to Walmart or go to Best Buy. Both stores have oodles of these right here in stock. It's like they're offloading them, getting rid of them. I think it's Dark Sky Entertainment put this one out. I believe it was. Dark Sky Films did this DVD presentation. They're only charging $5 for these guys. It's in a metal uh, protective tin there, kind of a clamshell deal. You can get, this is remastered in high definition. It's going to be very, very close to the Blu-ray quality. So guys, if you don't want to go the full nine and get the Blu-ray, get out there and get this while it's cheap. This is a collectible tin. It's five bucks. There, I plugged that enough. But anyway, I went ahead and bought one of these because it was, it was cheap, five bucks. And I thought, man, if my, if my Blu-ray ever bit the dust or my Blu-ray player went to put and I needed to really see Texas Chainsaw Massacre, I would have it. Or if anything, I'll leave it in the plastic and I'll give it away the next uh, uh, horror movie giveaway contest or something like that. But there again, it got, it, I just wanted to include that to both plug it and plus show it off because it's got a cool metal uh, case, which I think is a pro for it, even though it's a two disc versus a one disc. Um, the Blu-ray is just a standard Blu-ray case with a little insert, um, but the DVD case is kind of a step up in presentation. You might give up a little bit in the definition of the picture, but anyways, just thought I'd show you that one. Uh, let's put that aside for a moment. 